Hello guys and welcome to this new Power BI tutorial. In this video, I'm going to create this dashboard using healthcare data set. As you can see, we are going to create different KPIs. We have line chart, donut chart, scatter plot. We have bar charts, tree map, and stacked bar chart. You can find this link in the description to download the data set directly from Kaggle. As you can see here from the about data set, we have a sample healthcare data set which has been created to serve as valuable resource for data science, machine learning, and data analysis. So basically it has been created for educational and research purposes which means it's not real data from hospitals and different doctors so we can see here in the columns we have the name which represents the name of the patient the age the gender we have the blood type medication conditions we have different conditions date of admission we have the doctor the hospital the insurance provider we have the billing amount so everything is us dollars room number the admission type which specifies the type of admission which can be emergency elective or urgent we have discharge date medication and we have test results so for our dashboard i have picked some of these columns right i created some new measures in order to create our dashboard so the first thing that we are going to do is that we are going to create some measures right so we start with the average age so create new measure average age equals to the average healthcare age so the name of data set is healthcare and the name of the column is age right then we have the total patients right same thing it is count rows of the data set which is healthcare then we have average billing new as dollars which is average of the billing account of the data set right so average healthcare billing amount then we have total billing and you ask dollars also which is the sum same thing of the billing account and we have the average billing per condition so basically we write average billing per condition in us dollars equals to we divide healthcare total billing that we have calculated by distinct count of the medical condition which means the total conditions that we have in the data set so after creating all these measures for me i will just create a new page the first thing to do is to change the background so I put it in black transparency 0% and to create our first card so here the first one will be most common condition so we select here medical condition in the filters we put condition top and select one and it will be by the Count. Apply. I'm going to format that. So we start with a value, it will be 25 in white. Label, put it 10, same thing in white. The background black and the border in white. 10 white all right so here we have our first card decrease a little bit copy paste this one six times all right now select all of them, format, align top, and distribute horizontally. Okay, select all of them one more time. Is it right to be centered? Right, so we remove the filter for all of them. Now the second one, it will be total patients, right? Next, we have average billing. Next, we have total billing. The average age. And finally, we have average billing per condition. 
okay so like that we have our kpis next we have line chart so select line chart so it will be billion per year right so billion amount per year can select the year or the month okay we select the month all right so basically now we format that not need the titles grid lines also no need so for the background it will be black border in white 10 so the title it will be within amount by mass to be white 12 centered right for the x axis the values 8 white and same thing for the y axis white the line also we can put it in white okay increase a little bit next one it will be bar chart So this one will be patients by medical condition remove everything we have medical condition and the count of name to be bar chart okay now for the x-axis we remove the values add the labels so they will be white and same thing for the bars we we'll put them white so the title should be patients by medical condition okay next we have total billing by insurance provider so it will be column chart we have insurance provider and the total billing so this one will be total billing by insurance provide okay next one it will be another bar chart put it here which will be top 10 doctors by total billing So basically, we select doctor top 10 by the sum of the billing amount. Okay, so the title will be total billing by doctor. top 10 okay next it will be so copy paste this one
admission type by gender, right? So on the x axis, we have admission type, then we have the sum or the count, select percentage better, and on the legend, we select the gender. Okay. Now, the legend, we put it top center. Text should be white. And for the for the colors, for male we select white, and for female we select gray. Just for the labels, you can put them in black. All right. Next we have donut chart. So copy paste. On a chart, so we have gender distribution. This one is admission, admission type by gender, and for this one, it will be gender distribution. Gender distribution. Same thing, we are going to format that legend text in white, labels, same thing in white, and the slices. So for male, we put it white, and for female, we put it gray. All right, next we have Scala plot, it will be age versus billion amount. So same thing, copy paste this one. So it will be scatter plot, remove everything. So we have the age and the billing amount. So don't summarize, don't summarize. Just for this one, we need to remove the filter, right? Because we had here the top 10. Same thing for this one, we remove top 10. We just need to format that. So basically we remove the grid lines. For the values, they will be in white. Same thing in here, in white, and also for the title. title also for the x-axis white and also we can modify or edit the markers you can put it minus 30 okay so here it will be age versus billing amount Next we have tree map, so we have billing by hospital top 10. So we select tree map, put it down. So we have hospital, billing amount as the sum. And here we select the top 10 by the sum of the billing amount. Apply. Now we need to format that. So the background will be black. The border white 10. The title will be billing by hospital. Top 10, be white also. Now for the labels or category labels, 8, put them in black. 
and for the colors we select gradient lowest value in white the highest in gray for example okay all right so we have here the billing by hospital we have the top 10 and the last one it will be the table so we add matrix so on the rows we have critical condition and the columns we have the insurance provider the value it will be the sum of billing amount so for general effects background it will be black all right the border white 10 now for the values them 8 all right same thing here put the background as black black okay so the values put them in white okay the headers same thing background white color ground total same thing text color white black check for the color all right so we just need to change the grid to white okay now if you close everything we get exactly the same dashboard so for overall insights and the insights of each chart you can find the details in the description if you want for example this dashboard as case study where we have the problem statement and also how to solve that with this dashboard by giving insights for different charts so that's it for this tutorial i hope that you have learned new things thanks for watching and see you in next tutorial